Hey guys, hope you're all having a great week so far. So today I have a review for you on a new monthly beauty subscription website that has just came out. It is the Beauty Box 5. And if you're familiar with other websites like My Glam, Birchbox, Glossy Box, you get the point. So um, basically it is another monthly beauty subscription. Um, I personally do have experiences with My Glam and Birchbox. I am currently um, in the process of canceling my birch box. Um, I didn't cancel last month because honestly I just forgot and got lazy and didn't cancel before the end of the month which reminds me I need to do that before the month ends again um, but basically I've been trying them out for about a year and I have never repurchased any of the sample products that they've provided for me so um, I just feel like at this point after a year not purchasing anything I just feel like they're not a right fit for me, um, don't really meet my needs, and you know I don't really find anything new from what they send me, so um, I might as well save my $10 a month or put it towards you know better use. And as far as My Glam goes, I was subscribed to them, but when the whole you know fiasco of everybody hated My Glam and everything, my monthly subscription accidentally got canceled or deactivated. I don't know how, but since my glam was giving really crappy products at that time i didn't really mind and i didn't bother to email anybody and let them know like hey you canceled me and i never wanted to be canceled so yeah i am on the hunt for a new monthly beauty subscription and just from checking out the website um, i really saw a lot of brands that Beauty Box 5 works with that are recognizable brands to me and brands that I already use. So I was a little excited about that and when they contacted me I, you know, definitely jump on board because, um, you know, I wanted to kind of see what they offer and, you know, see if this box might be the one for me. And obviously I wanted to do a review to, you know, kind of get it out to you guys and see if maybe this is something that will work with your needs and something that would be interesting to you. So basically like any other monthly beauty subscription it does have a fee it is $12 a month but they do have different like um, packages that you can do so like if you wanted to do a quarterly package then it's only $30 so um, you save yourself a little money there and if you did want to go ahead and commit for a whole year then you get it for a hundred dollars which saves you about you know a little over forty dollars so I do like that they give you a couple different options as to you know how much you want to spend for the subscription they also have a program that is called care uh, sharing is caring and basically if you get five of your friends to subscribe for the box then you will get one box for free so that was really interesting and really cool about the website um, and you do get four to five deluxe samples and I did already open my box because I wanted to get a feel for what was in here and give you guys like my honest opinion about the box and how I feel about it if it's worth it so um, the deluxe samples are actual deluxe samples so I was really excited about that um, but yeah let's go ahead and get into the box and check it out so it comes in this little box like this um, it does look tiny, but from experience, um, I do feel like sometimes companies try to compensate their little product samples with like bigger boxes to make you think that, oh, you're getting a lot of product. But in reality, you're really getting like little Sephora sized samples, which for Sephora is fine because they're free, but not when I'm paying $10 a month. Uh uh. I want a deluxe sample. So I would much rather have a little box like that jam-packed with samples like this than a huge empty box with a lot of tissue. So your um, samples come in a little organza bag like this and then it just has a little bit of filler in there and a little card like this that says thank you for your business from Beauty Box 5 and on the back it gives you just more information on the website and um, you know about the brands um, how to complete your beauty profile on there and also about the sharing is caring program that they have um, they don't have one of the cards that kind of explains the products that are in here and the prices and stuff so if you do like getting those um, cards then I don't know if it's just like the because they sent it to me and it's the first box 
I don't know if they plan on doing those cards in the future. I don't know, but um, that might be kind of a deal breaker if you're the type of person that really likes to see um, information and check out the prices and stuff. Um, I personally don't mind, but I don't know, other people might. So let's go ahead and get into this little bag. The first thing that I'm going to pull out is the the all natural face vegan eyeshadow and this is in peach ice it is a really pretty color um, I actually used it as a highlight the other day and um, it can be um, a eyeshadow as well it's kind of like a pigment and it's just really really pretty um, it's really subtle and it's not chalky at all it has like a nice shimmer but it's not too like overbearing you know um, and I just I really thought that this was really pretty. I also like the fact that it's kind of like a multi-use product so you can use it as a highlight or you can use it as eyeshadow. So that was really convenient. And the next thing that is in here is the Bodyography Foundation Primer in Clear. It is just um, like a regular primer and um, it's just clear. It's kind of like got that silicone feel and that's what I really like in my primers just because I like the way it fills in my pores more and stuff like that. So I did use this this morning and it has kept my makeup on pretty, you know, stayed on put. Um, the only thing that I did notice um, and the reason I noticed it right off the bat was because I watched my friend's um, beauty box reviews too and they had mentioned it in here so I definitely needed to see what it was all about. Um, but it definitely does have a more masculine scent. To me it kind of almost smells like a man's deodorant, like Old Spice deodorant or like aftershave. Um, but I don't know if it smells as strong as like cologne, but it definitely smells like old man-ish. Um, but it's not too strong. I don't know. Um, I wasn't a huge fan of the scent, so I don't know if Bodyography can maybe make something a little more feminine friendly. Um, but yeah, that's the only thing. It did work really well. Um, I can't complain, but as far as scent, um, I would definitely recommend for them to make this either scentless or, like I said, feminine friendly. So, um, didn't really like the scent of this, but yeah. Mm -hmm. And then... The next thing that's in here is the Pure Lease. I have gotten some samples of the Pure Lease, like I think in Birchbox or Glam Bag or something. But the samples I got from them were little like sleeve ones that you get at Sephora. Um, and this is an actual like full size deluxe sample um, of the, oh, I didn't even tell you what it was. It's the Pure Lease um, Gentle Soy Milk Cleanser and Makeup Remover for all skin types. Um, I actually used this the last couple nights um, and it removes makeup pretty well. I, I heard that for like waterproof mascara and waterproof makeup this doesn't work that great. I personally don't use waterproof mascara and makeup so um, I didn't have a problem with this at all. Um, it was really gentle. I kind of, you know, I appreciated the smell. It's kind of soft and it doesn't, you know, it's, it just smells really clean smelling. So. I liked it and it worked well for me um, and I like the fact that it's a huge sample so I'll get to try it more than one time with you know the little itty bitty samples but um, the next things that are in here are the it's a 10 miracle hair mask and it's a 10 is probably one of my favorite favorite hair products I used to use the leave-in conditioner all the time right now I'm not using it because I'm currently using some other stuff that my hairdresser put me on but I have tried the hair mask and absolutely love it so I was really happy about getting these two samples in here um, so you'll get two uses uh, that was freaking awesome. The last thing that is in here is the Smith's Rosebud Salve and I want to say that they sell this brand at Sephora. Don't quote me on that but I'm almost positive I've seen this brand there or like Ulta or something like that and you guys know that Things at Sephora are not that cheap, so I was kind of excited about this and the fact that it is like a full-size sample, or not sample, it's a full-size product of this. So um, basically you can use it like as a chapstick or like a very 
a moisturizer for like very dry and chapped skin. Um, kind of similar to like Aquaphor, which is what I use right now for like the days that my skin or like elbows and you know places that you get like rough patches at. Um, that's what I use currently, but this is awesome just because it smells a little better. It smells like roses. That is everything that was in my box. And um, okay, so would I purchase the subscription to this box? Definitely, I do think that I am going to um, try out this monthly subscription just because I'm currently not gonna have one at the moment. Um, and I appreciate the fact that even though, um, you know, I may not be too familiar with some of the products in here, um, you know, I haven't used a lot of the Pure Lease, at least I can get a good um, you know trial run out of these and try it for more than one time you know I appreciate that the deluxe samples are actually deluxe sizes so I can try these out for a couple weeks and really know if I'm gonna like them fall in love with them whatever and repurchase them which you know a lot of the times with little samples that you can only use one time you can't tell if you're gonna like it and want to buy it again so um, I really did appreciate that you know they were actual legit samples and I like that there's brands in here that people are familiar with so you know and um, you know a full-size product who can't be happy with that so um, I think that I'm gonna go for the three month um, subscription just because it's comparable in price with other monthly subscriptions for ten dollars a month um, and also I want to you know obviously try it out for more than a month but I don't want to commit to a whole year just in case you know my glam went through the hole they gave you two awesome bags and then on the third bag it was like a bunch of crap so I don't want to go through that again um, with you know other monthly subscriptions I really hope that this is you know what you can kind of expect every month obviously some months are going to be better than others but you know um, they obviously started out with you know a good amount of products and sample sizes so I hope that they keep it up um, but like I said three months will kind of give you enough time to know if this subscription is you know working for you or not so that is pretty much it I really hope that this review was helpful to you guys like I said I will link um, all of the website and information um, down below so you can check out their website check out the brands the different programs and everything that has to do with this box um, but yeah I will see you guys on the next video I love you all Mwah. bye